Hello and welcome to Prime at 9. I am Esther. A two day conference of Northeast Tourism and Culture Ministers concluded on September 14 at Guwahati. It was organized by the Ministry of Tourism, Government of India. The conference was inaugurated yesterday by G. Kishan Reddy, Union Minister of Tourism, Culture and Donor, along with Chief Minister of Assam, Himanta Biswa Sarma. Arvind Singh, Secretary, Ministry of Tourism, Government of India, while addressing the second day of the two-day conference, said that the conference has been successful in apprising the participants about several projects and initiatives being undertaken by the central government for the development of the Northeast region. The second day deliberations in the conference were discussed on issues related to tourism infrastructure, capacity building, IEC, connectivity and performance of states on work in progress projects under Swadesh Darshan and Prasad. Nagaland Tourism Department led by Advisor Edge Kehovi Yeptomi attended the conference and made presentations on all issues discussed as well as flagged. Problematic areas faced by Nagaland Tourism were also highlighted and largely addressed. Discussion was also held with regard to the International Tourism Mart to be held in Kohima around the last week of November 2021. Joint Director of the Tourism Department Nagaland, VLO Dulo, spoke to this channel regarding a few aspects in the tourism sector of Nagaland. If the third wave, we never know, but if not, it's in the pip pipeline, yeah. The department is mentally pre prepared, so, and also our advisor and commissioner, and also, hopefully, yeah, even the Ministry of Tourism, they wanted, they insisted us to conduct. Okay. In fact, everybody is looking forward for it, the whole North, Northeast, even the Ministry of Tourism. And thankfully, our commissioner and our advisor, they're up to the mark. So the only thing is that the ter third wave, let's hope that the third wave doesn't hit us. See, uh, the problem we face is the carrying capacity. Because the carrying cap capacity, what I mean by that is that accommodation facilities. So we have a, we hardly have uh, uh, good hotels. Thankfully, uh, of late, new good hotels have come up, but especially in Kohima, we don't have a national in, in standards. Only one, three, four, five. I should say two, three hotels. So our main setback is the carrying capacity. You see, uh, central government has given a special focus on the northeastern states, and because of that, they have conducted international tourism mart that is specially focused on northeast India. So, uh, when we talk about international tourism mart, see, uh, it is like this: uh, it is in a rotational basis, where all the northeastern states have been given a chance to host the okay. international tourism mart. So in that event, uh, minimum 200 to 300 or sometimes 400 international tour operators used mm -hmm. to attend. So Nagaland was given a chance once, but due to our uh, hotel facilities, they came for Reggie, the Ministry of Tourism, they came for inspection, but they were not satisfied due to our hotel uh, standards. Now, Every 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 state has hosted, except Nagaland and Mizoram. So this year, the Ministry of Tourism is insi insisting or requesting us to host international tourism bar. So hopefully, with some upcoming new hotels, so we are prepared, mentally prepared, physically also we are prepared. So and even the highest level, the government level, they are also willing, which okay. I cannot speak on behalf of the highest level policymaker, but yeah. I think we are prepared, yeah, mentally as a department, yeah.